feel. Thing. The day has barely dawned, my fellow early riser. Though we're hardly alone in that. Envious of those still sleeping soundly, no doubt. Called out to you, you say? Hmm. I've heard nothing myself. In any case, I dare say the sea air will do you good. Why not join the others on deck? Charlian should be coming into view at any moment. My voice yet reaches you. I am glad. Hear. Feel. Think. And thus do we meet face to face at last. My warrior of light, guided by the crystal. After your sojourn in the first, I believe you have your answer. You have gained an understanding of what I truly am, what Eidolon has always been, a primer. Zodiac was created to forestall the apocalypse which threatened the ancient world and I was brought forth to bind him. Yet seven times now, those who would orchestrate a return to that bygone era had rejoined a shard to the god I had sundered. The greater his strength grows, the swifter does mine own diminish. The power to draw your mind into the rift betwixt is no longer mine to wield. Yet though it taxes me sorely, I dare not leave these words unsaid. Even bereft of my guidance, you and your companions have accepted the burden of this star's troubled past. A conjunction has begun to fall, an intertwining of your time and mine. Wheels shudder and turn, conflict looms, monumental, which will decide the fate of this world and all life upon it. When you truly understand what is at stake, and your journey has prepared you to surmount the insurmountable, then shall I honor the promise made in another time, and 
another age. Cast your peepers to the fore, folks. Charlians just over yonder. I will not keep you further. Your traveler's heart must yearn to behold this unfamiliar land. We shall meet again, and soon. What a fine morning. Oh, still a bit stiff, though. And a good morning to you, too. Taken a look at the island already? Then let's go. Let's go! Might still be room in the prow if we're lucky. Sleepers have arisen. <sighs> there she is. <laughs> Good old Charlian. Oh, I see it. Home. Home at last. Well. Maybe not in father's eyes, but we'll manage on our own, if we must. You do know you're not alone in this, don't you? Indeed, tis as Sir Estinian said. Forget not the comrades who boarded this ship at your side, I prithee. Thank you, my friends. We are ever grateful for your steadfast support. Upon arrival, we will be disembarking into the heart of Charlian proper. There is no greater concentration of wisdom in all the world. I am confident that somewhere within that center of knowledge and learning, we will find the answers we seek. <laughs>